Welcome back. Thousands marched in Glasgow to demand more action on the climate crisis. The protest was the biggest so far during the COP26 summit and took place alongside hundreds of similar events around the world. Bahardat brings us this report. <laughs> The drums are rolling, the temperature is dipping. But here in Glasgow, the chant for climate action is only growing louder. And I say brainwash, you say cup out, brainwash. Tell me, can you feel it? Getting louder by the hour. Getting louder by the hour. You've risked getting your baby out here in the midst of a pandemic. Why are you here? Well, I'm here because we need to be here for future generations, for my son. There's time, the time is running out now to tackle climate change. There are 70 corp 100 corporations worldwide which are responsible for 70% of climate in emissions. And the world leaders who are amassing in Glasgow today are not willing to take those people on. They work in their interests. And why is he dressed as a dinosaur? Well, basically, he just wanted to say that um, he thinks the dinosaurs thought they had time to uh -huh. and of course they didn't and that was the end of them so whatever way they went um our extinction can come from the climate change and he's just trying to pass the point that we have to act now and not not leave until he is my age to okay. start doing something we're here at uh, this protest to demand that uh, world leaders take more action um you know, big businesses, big oil companies, the US military, these are the top polluters in society. Not everyday working class people like ourselves. Um, we need to hold them to account. We need to stop them from making false promises. There are people with their pets, mothers with their kids, the young, the old. Perhaps the biggest strength of the climate march is the sheer numbers. The city of Glasgow is in lockdown not for the pandemic, but to facilitate the movement of a large swell of protesters. Almost 50,000 people are expected to march to the city square. As the final countdown begins for COP26, for India, the key issues still remain climate justice and finance. The climate crisis is at your door. That's what thousands of protesters are saying here who are gathered here for the protest march. The police have sealed off most parts of the city so that all these protesters can march right as close to COP26 where delegates and world leaders are figuring out how they can save the planet. What protesters are in fact saying is that what's going on inside is not enough. I'll be getting you all the latest updates right here from the epicenter of the march. For India Today, this is Bahadur.